Hi, I'm Scott Held from Sherwood Dodge. Every week I meet people who have damaged their credit score in some way or another, and while the stories differ somewhat, the, there's kind of a common theme. A lot of times bad things happen to good people. There's a lot of misinformation out there about what it takes to uh, repair a credit score and how to get your credit back on track, so I want to talk about that today. I understand how stressful it can be when you're trying to get a car loan or, or um, you've been turned down for a loan before. Um, I haven't always been a car dealer. I've had a bunch of car loans in my life and I can remember sitting across the desk from a, a guy waiting to see if I qualified for a car loan and it's, it's not a, a real fun position to be in and I have a pretty good idea what that's like. So I just want to put a video together to uh, help my, my customers and potential customers, even if you don't buy from us, uh, hopefully this is informative and uh, we'll give you a bit of a road map to get through the, the minefield that the, uh, the, finance, the finances after a uh, personal credit problem uh, can be. Up to 20, 20 to 30% of all Canadians uh, will have some difficulty obtaining credit uh, when they purchase a new vehicle. Uh, chances are, even if, it, if that's not you, you know somebody that's, that's had a problem at, it at one time or another. Um, most of us in our lives um, will have some negative financial event um, that causes us to be a few months behind in credit card payments, things of that nature. Um, a lot of people that have had credit problems think that they, their options are very limited. And while that might have been true five years ago, not so much anymore. Um, and I just want to talk about how you go about getting the best options for you. There's no shortcut to repairing your credit. It's not easy, it takes time, and beware of anybody that's advertising or telling you otherwise. Uh, there's lots and lots of newspaper, television, radio advertisements out there claiming all kinds of uh, amazing and wonderful things that they're gonna be able to do immediately for you on your credit, and uh, I would say be very wary of those. So what those ads are designed to do is get a lot of people to phone in um, with possibly unrealistic expectations They'll quickly get some credit information from you, your social insurance number, your full uh, name and address and all that information. They'll run a quick credit check on you and uh, what they try to do is take, take frankly the easy ones. Um, if it's a deal that's going to take more than 24 hours or a couple of days to get approved, in most cases they'll drop it and, uh, and move on. It's more cost effective and time effective for a lot of dealerships to just continue to advertise for new customers and, uh, and take the easier deals. Ironically, one of the problems we encounter when we're trying to help somebody repair their credit is that they've uh, done a lot of credit shopping. They've um, filled lots of applications out all over town and uh, applied for different vehicles, uh, maybe different credit cards. And uh, credit companies, credit grantors, will label uh, you as a credit seeker. Most loans officers look very uh, poorly at an application where they figure that everybody else has turned you down. Uh, so the, the net uh, advice that I would give you on that is find a company or, or two at the most that you feel comfortable with and you feel that you have some confidence they're going to work hard for you and have them work your application hard. Get realistic, straightforward answers from them and uh, stick with them and try and get the deal you want. Don't uh, just keep going all over town because every one of those credit inquiries lowers your credit score. We're not going to make promises that everybody gets approved or if you work you drive um, because those are, those are misleading. Um, the reality is the only way anybody legally backs up those claims is that uh, they say, oh yes, you are approved, but we need 95% down. You know, you're buying a 15,000 car and we need 14,000 down. Sure, you're approved, uh, but it's not really what you're looking for. We're not going to make those claims. Um, not everybody is going to be approved at favorable terms, but uh, in a lot of cases, we can, with hard work and some patience by both you and, uh, and, and us working hard on it, we can find you a vehicle at, at very favorable terms. It's exceedingly expensive to advertise for new customers. And uh, it's my experience that short-term financial problems are just that, they're short-term. And if we work hard to help our customers through their short-term financial problems, we're pretty confident that many of them are going to come back to us for years and those short-term financial problems are worked out and uh, we can sell you many vehicles. 
Uh, bottom line, it's good for business and it's good for customers. If you know someone who's uh, having trouble getting a vehicle loan or you think this uh, video might help them, uh, please forward this to them. Um, I'll do the best I can to, to help them out. And if you have uh, more questions, uh, write something on my blog. I read every email, I read every post, and I'll do my best to answer it.